2K, 2K, 2K. Y'all really have my lockdown out here shooting better than a pure sharp. I shoot way more consistent than pure sharp. I shoot way more consistent than a pure scratch. You might thought I was a pure sharp the whole time with lockdown takeover. But no, 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 no. I'm a perimeter lock. I'm out here spraying like it ain't no other. But look, look, look. Today, I will be releasing my jump shot to y'all. A lot of people have been asking me on Twitter and comments, what's your lockdown jump shot? What jump shot are you using? What base is that? What release are you using? Because that's not a regular release. Most people are like, oh, is that Damian Lillard? No, it's not Damian Lillard. Because a lot of people keep asking me that as well. Or Kevin Love mixed with Damian Lillard. No. So look. This jump shot right here, yes, I have an 83 pointer. For anybody that wants to know, I have an 83 pointer. So make sure you remember that in your head. I do have an 80. I get Hall of Fame shooting badges. So it's not really that hard to be able to shoot on a lockdown. But how I shoot on a lockdown, you would not know I'm a lockdown how I shoot. Have y'all seen what I've been putting on my Twitter? If you haven't seen what I put on Twitter, make sure you go follow me on Twitter right now. And if some of y'all think I'm just doing this in YouTube videos, you must not follow me on Twitch. You can go watch my past broadcasts. You can follow me on Twitch right now, put on post notifications for that as well. But you don't miss when I go live on Twitch because, hey, if you think it's just in videos, make sure you go check it out when I go live. Because when I go live, we, we on. We on and popping. We hooping. This year, a lot of people are considering me basically the best shooting lock on the game. But if you don't remember, I was one of the best dribblers on the game. So look, look, look. I don't think I want to do this lockdown era, but it was fun while it lasted. I had very much fun. Being one of the best shooting lockdowns in the game. Now all I can do is just spread the knowledge that I have playing lockdown to y'all. For anybody that wants to play lockdown. Anybody wants to shoot good as lockdown. But I think I'm about to go part ways and go back to my dribbling habits. But if you want me to go back to my dribbling habits for sure. Let's get this video to 500 likes. That's all I'm asking. 500 likes and I'm going back to my dribble habits. I'm going back to ISO. We're not going to be using screens. We're going to be in our bag. You might see me come play stage. I'm liking how the dribbling is kind of this year, but little things need to be tweaked here and there just to make it more better. And I bet you you wondering, can your mama even ISO this year? Can he even dribble? Oh, you must have not watched my dribble tutorial. Yeah, I wouldn't drop a dribble tutorial if I didn't know how to dribble. It doesn't make any sense. That's a lot, a lot of people in the community to drop videos that they don't know how to do or don't they're not good at. They just wanted to drop a video just to drop a video. I'm not like how everybody else is that show you gameplays that them going 5 for 5, 6 for 6, 8 for 8, 9 for 9. I'm going to show you some realistic type of gameplay. I'm going to show you gameplays that, yes, you can miss with this shot. I ain't about to, you seen all them greens in the preview, but that don't mean nothing. That don't mean you must throw this jump shot on green just like that. You It's not like that. You actually have to practice. Some people ask me, how do I shoot with the jump shot meter on? I've been shooting with the meter on for the last four years. So what what changed now? Even though you get a boost when you take your meter off, what changed for me? I know how to time my jump shot. That's one thing with it. So a lot of people ask me as well, what do you play on your mama? Do you play on TV? Do you play on monitor? Yes, I play on monitor. My monitor, it has great response time. So anybody's gonna use the jump shot, make sure you have quick draw on gold or hall of fame. That's the main two. If you have it on silver, it's gonna be super slow for you. I'm just gonna let you know that. It's gonna be super slow. So keep it on gold or Hall of Fame. If you don't have that, I won't even want you to try it. I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm telling you 100%. Don't even try if you don't got quick draw on least gold. Don't, don't, or you can't even get it on gold. But make sure, when using this jump shot, practice with it. I use this in a rec, Pro M 5v5, Pro M 3v3, Park, My Career, Events. I haven't changed this jump shot since the game came out. So anybody that's like, Oh, Chamama, so why you didn't post a video? If you actually paid attention, this is the same jump shot. Literally, the same jump shot. Only thing I took off was one thing. I took off a badge. I took off one badge and traded it for another badge. So anybody that's watching this video, you may be watching the same jump shot video from before. I'm just letting you know that out right now. You're watching the same jump shot maybe. But if you're new, this might be new for you. So you see, I'm, I'm going crazy. I'm going 14 points, 83%. I did lag in one jump shot. I was like, bro, wow. So we end up ending this game. We end up, I told the truth, in the game, in the game, in the game. I went four for five from the three, five for six for field goal. But look, these are the badges that you're going to need, or these the badges are I'm using right now. So look, I usually run this. I use catch and shoot on goal, 
Dead Iron Go, Green Machine or Hall of Fame. If you can get Green Machine on Hall of Fame, use Green Machine. It works. Range Extender on Hall of Fame and Quick Draw. You really don't need Range Extender on Hall of Fame for what I'm doing, but I like to shoot on the wing sometimes, like actually shoot hash. But this is what it looks like when I spot up in the corner. I put Catch and Shoot on Hall of Fame and Corner Specialist on Silver. You may be asking, why do you put it on Silver? Why not higher? Silver is the best pet. Actually, Silver is the best Corner Specialist in the game. You go any higher, Silver will work better than Hall of Fame. But also, another badge people sleep on is Hot Start and Volume Shooter. Make sure you try them two badges out right now. You can try them out in, in you know what I'm saying? You can try them in my career just to test it out. Or you can try it out in the wreck. Or you can try it at the park. But look, look, now it's time. It's time, it's time, it's time. Y'all been waiting for this jump shot. Maybe some of y'all at this point, y'all maybe skip to the video. Y'all like, okay, when is he going to show me the jump shot? He skipped right to the video around this point. But if you haven't skipped to this video, let me know in the comment section. I did not skip. So look, we hopping in this jump shot. Look, jump shot creator. If you don't have jump shot creator, I will just tell you to use this base. Or I can give you actual better bases. If you want a video like that, or I give you actual better bases, I can tell you that as well. But the jump shot I use, the jump shot I use is Rudy Gay base, John Wall, John Wall. This jump shot has not failed me this year. It hasn't. This is the jump shot I scored 118 points on with my lock now. This jump shot is the one that helps me get on the leaderboards for Pro 3v3. I'm telling you, this jump shot is amazing. But if you don't like how slow it is, like, it's not as slow, but a lot of people like fast base jump shots. It's always good to have a fast base jump shot, but this one is perfect for what I do. So, if you're a spot up, you're a stretch big, you're a sharpshooter, this will be an actually good jump shot for you. Hands down. Because I know a lot of people do off ball. This is actually, get, you have enough time to do off ball and shoot with this. I actually use this jump shot on my new ISO build that I've been using. I still have my playmaker slasher, but I do have another ISO build that I've been using lately. And I like it even better using this jump shot. I do get Hall of Fame quick draw, but I've been usually using gold on my new ISO build. Just so I can adjust to it for right now. Because even though my mind player is a little smaller, I'm still greening up. It doesn't matter. I'm still going to green up, but I think it would be way more fun or more entertaining if I'm on my guard again. So anybody that wants me to get on my guard, I told you what was the requirement. Get this video to 500 likes. I showed you the jump shot. I showed you how amazing this jump shot is. And this is one of the gems that I will be giving out to y'all. So anybody that's a lock sharp, a sharp shooter, a stretch big, a rebounding uh, sharp, use this jump shot. Try it. A lot of people are like, oh, I don't want to try it. Oh, it looks very slow. Try it. I'm telling you. It's easy timing. You see, I shoot with a meter and time it. So imagine if you shoot without a meter. You might be more godly than me. That's one thing I want to put that in your head. Remember, you get a 6% boost when you use no jump shot meter. Imagine if I didn't use a jump shot meter. Most of my shots were maybe be green every time. As y'all was paying attention to my jump shot, look at my stat line. Five points, five rebounds. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Five points, five rebounds, one assist. That is, that's two steals right there. Hey, I think I'm done playing lockdown. I proved myself as being a lockdown on this game. That's all I wanted to do. I just want to show y'all I can play multiple builds. Y'all might know just me from dribbling. I, I can shoot. I can play scratch. Y'all, if I can play lock, I definitely can play scratch big. As you see, I got three steals, four steals. Ooh, piece of candy! Like, come on, man. What do I have to explain? What do I have to prove? I don't gotta prove nothing no more. Me doing this does not have to make me prove anything. Cause now. I'm satisfied. I know I'm one of the best shooting locks on the game. Not the best, but one of the best. Remember what I said? One of the best, but I'm not the best. As you see, I love this build so much, but I have to go back to my dribbling ways. It's just, it's just cold heart. I gotta go back to my dribbling ways. And I think it's more of a challenge when you're dribbling and then you try to shoot a shot. Cause most of the times you might be out of stamina, you might not, and it might look better y'all getting jump shot videos after I get a clip and shooting a brain than me just spying up or me running down the court shooting easy three and pulling up or me dead eyeing somebody but I think it'd be more entertaining for y'all let me know in the comment section would y'all want to still see lockdown Chamama here and there or y'all want to see dribble sensei Chamama return because I'm excited I'm ready to make the change dribble sensei Chamama is ready to come back 2k8 I, I'm telling you 2k18 dribble sensei Chamama will be back on 2k20 Y'all just don't understand. But if you made it this far in the video, make sure you drop a like. Make sure you drop a sub. Put on post notifications if you haven't yet. Also, follow me on Twitter and Twitch. We do go live almost each other day. If we don't, 
something went happened, something went wrong, my PC crashed, something. But if then you mess your mama, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'm all y'all. Peace.